Hello. A severe week of weather ahead, so much so that the Met Office have named two storms, Dudley and Eunice, as well as issued an amber warning for Wednesday night into the start of Thursday. Storm Dudley comes along first of all and will be picked up by a very powerful jet stream coming at 200 mile per hour out of Newfoundland and that uh, storm is going to deepen during Tuesday as it crosses the Atlantic, reaching northern parts of the UK on Wednesday night. That's when the strongest of the winds occur and the worst of the winds are likely to affect central and southern Scotland parts of Northern Ireland as well as northern England. Quickly, that moves out of the way during Thursday. Meanwhile, something that doesn't even form until Thursday itself, Storm Eunice deepens very rapidly as it approaches and as it crosses southern half of the UK. And this one's likely to bring the strongest of the winds to southern parts of England and Wales with the risk of disruptive snow occurring on its northern flank. So let's put a bit more detail on these storms. Storm Dudley at first comes along later Wednesday. And in fact, the winds really pick up later in the afternoon and into the start of the evening for the northern half of the UK. Widespread gales, North Wales northwards, and those winds uh, reaching 70 miles per hour as far as the gusts are concerned in the yellow warning area. And within that area, an amber warning has been issued. Central and southern Scotland, parts of Northern Ireland and Northern England, where there's the risk in some places, even inland, of 80 mile per hour wind gusts. And for some of the most exposed coasts and hills, 90 mile per hour wind gusts. Disruption to travel, dangerous conditions around coasts, and even structural damage possible with these kinds of wind speeds. That's why an amber warning's been issued. That's why Storm Dudley has been named. Then, during Thursday, out of nowhere, Storm Eunice forms and really deepens very quickly as it approaches the UK. When these storms deepen as they cross the UK, there is some uncertainty and we're still four or five days ahead. So there's some uncertainty about the track and depth of Eunice, but it does look likely to bring another period of stormy weather, this time focused across southern parts of the UK. And so uh, at the moment, a yellow warning is in force and uh, it looks likely that Storm Eunice is going to bring widely gales for the southern half of the UK, particularly around southwestern and southern coasts. And uh, within this warning area, we can expect 70 mile per hour wind gusts with the risk. Even inland, there's the possibility of 80 mile per hour wind gusts. Not only that, but uh, for the northern half of the warning area, there's the risk of significant and disruptive snowfall, even blizzard conditions uh, for some parts of North Wales, Northern England, Southern Scotland. And so, uh, yeah, lots going on with the weather this week. Warnings are in force. They'll be updated throughout the next few days. Stay across the warnings, stay across the forecasts, and you can follow the updates throughout social media channels. Bye bye.